My name is Henry Turner and I like painting things and making strange things and doing unusual things which appeal to me. It wasn't easy I had when I was a when I was quite 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 small with some paint in it. I don't remember this, I was told this and so I would get these paints and oil pastels and pencils and things out and fool around with them and it was quite fun and rather satisfying. Once you've spent about 10 years or so learning how to do it, then you can start to break and bend rules and you can otherwise manipulate and force it to work for you. And then the paint starts fighting. And Well, I have more control over paint than I have over many other, many other things so it suits me to some extent. It's a bit impulsive really and I might at any time in the day or night have some sort of idea and I'll think it through a bit more and perhaps one afternoon in which I've been gardening or making lunch or fin finishing uh, the things which I should be working on for a commission or an exhibition or something, I shall suddenly exclaim to hell with this, find some a sheet of paper or something and just start it. At the moment I'm concocting a sort of synthesis of music and circus and gardens and birds and also la large trees because it was always a surfeit of human things but they never seem to be quite so much of natural things and being a somewhat perverse and aspergic individual that always seem to appeal. I don't really interact much with my own age group. There's only been a handful of individuals who may ever have and so I'm not altogether certain of what's normal anymore. And so my associates are generally a lot older than me and quite strange or interested in the same things that I'm interested in and so at school I never really had a lot of friends. I think I'm a bit autistic and I'm certainly on the spectrum. I find it, I find it hard to converse with people in everyday life. A bit introverted really. It's more of a blessing, it's what allows me to paint things. So I like ride, riding bikes, in particular a penny farthing. When I'm on the penny farthing I usually expound upon the, these things to clarify them in my mind and just to pass the time re really. I want to create some gardens which are quite singular and I'd like them to be rather huge and in strange places and I want to do some large exhibitions with lots and lots and lots of paintings and sculptures and flower arrangements and paintings of them and light and shadow and imaginary realms and worlds and I've picked up bird skulls and curiosities and so in a magpie-like way, just collecting strange objects. I'd quite like to, to create a chamber of gilded horrors. It's sort of a very small room, and so I take some big hangings of canvases and paint, all sorts of flowers and sculptures and monsters and creatures and mowers and skulls and birds and things, and just have hundreds and hundreds of them against a golden ground. That must sound, sound a bit strange. Ah, oh, well.